I'm having fish tonight. Welcome back to Kingdom Hearts. Today, we are going to gather some more supplies for Kyrie so that we can uh, stock up in preparation for the boat expedition to find more worlds. But first, I got to, there we go, catch a fish. Nice. Uh, let's see, uh, are all of them around here or are there others on the other side of the island? I'm not completely sure. I distinctly remember that there was those two there at least. Uh, let's see. Uh, tell you what, let's do what uh, the game instructs us to from the start. Let's actually try using first person mode more often rather than just blindly uh, wandering around. It's a little bit tricky to deal with sometimes. Uh, okay, it doesn't look like there's anything. And apart from this, what did we need? Three mushrooms? Now, if I recall, they're actually... Oh, hang on. I saw it. I saw a fish. There we go. No, no pick it up. Nice. Now, anyway, uh, if I recall correctly, jump with circle, you numpty. If I recall correctly, there's actually three mushrooms back in the secret place where the door was. So I believe that if we go through here, maybe this time around we'll actually end up uh, getting that cutscene that I alluded to. Because I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be a special cutscene down here. I think... Uh, let's see, where are those mushrooms? I'm pretty sure there's at least one. Oh, here we go. Yep, that's a mushroom if I've ever seen it. Okay, here we go. Cutscene time. I knew there was something here, but I wanted to make sure. Everyone keeps saying that. I'm starting to get really curious. There is so very much to learn. You understand so little. Well, yeah. Well, you'll see. I'm gonna get out and learn what's out there. A meaningless effort. One who knows nothing can understand. That's a pretty creepy cutscene right there, actually. It's actually pretty intimidating, but uh, remember that voice. It's gonna be very important right at the end of the game. I think. I'm trying to recall. I, I think it's the same dude from the end of the game. Uh, spoiler alert. Yeah, don't worry. I'm not gonna get into too much detail of what happens at the end. Uh, largely because I remember almost nothing about it. Like I said, I've not played this game in ages. So, this is almost completely fresh. It's, it's just as new for me as it is for any of you guys who have never played it before. Uh, let's see. First of all, uh, before we jump into any story spoilers. Uh, well, no, ideally we'd not be jumping into any story spoilers at all. And I don't think I really have the capacity to do that because this is, like I said, this is almost completely fresh for me. Uh, let's see. Where the hell can I find a mushroom? Uh, well, we found most of the supplies over on this uh, uh, on this side, so I'm guessing that at least a couple of them will be over here. And uh, Riku, I want to bash your brains in so much with that wooden sword. And stealing my boat name, stealing my position as the captain, Even rubbing it in my face. I hate the dude so much. This is only the tipping, uh, this is only the tipping point, or rather the tip of the iceberg, I think is the expression. I'm, I'm not sure if tipping point is the, is the correct phrase to use here. That's a game show on ITV, in fact. No, no, it's, um, 
Yeah, that's just the tip of the iceberg. Yeah, it gets much worse. I, di I distinctly remember that about the game. That's probably one of the only things I remember about this game. Uh, well, well, a few things. I remember some things about this game. Uh, anyway, I don't remember where the mushroom is, but I want to say that it could be up here. It's entirely possible. Uh, let's see, here we get the fancy star again. I think we have the option to uh, light it up again, but I don't know why we'd ever need to. Uh, let's see, is there something through here actually? Oh yeah, yeah, there is. Uh, how the hell do I move this? Okay, there it is. Just run straight into it. Okay, there's all the food supplies, I believe. Now, Kyrie, are we ready to set sail on the SS Palutena? I refuse to call it the High Wind. I'm making a necklace of Thalassa shells. I don't, I don't know what that is. They were supposed to ensure a safe voyage. Hmm, I wonder if there's any foreshadowing going on there. That was quick. Let's see what's still missing. Two coconuts! Come on! Aww. Uh, of course there was going to be something. Uh, right, okay. Where the hell do we find coconuts? Um, could definitely do with a hint game. Damn it! I can't jump properly either. Uh, okay, fine. We'll do first person mode again. Uh, I don't think there's going to be any in the trees. Well, actually, no. That makes perfect sense for them to be in the trees. It's just a matter of which trees we're thinking of. Uh, we've not been up there yet. I wonder if there's anything there. Uh, possibly. I would assume that there's coconuts in the trees, and you've either got to climb the tree trunk or knock them out, but uh, we'll get into that in a bit. Yeah, we've not been up here yet. I want to see what's going on. Oh, that's... Oh, you've got to be kidding me! You've got to be kidding me! That would have been a shortcut. That would have been a shortcut to the star, and I would have had a chance. I would have been in with a solid chance of showing Riku what was what. Oh, 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 this game just doesn't stop rubbing it in. Oh, 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 I know we're off to a bad start. I swear I like this game, everyone. I know I've been complaining a lot, but I swear I do like this game. It is a great game that I would recommend highly, but good God, it really does rub some stuff in your face. Right, okay. Now, where the hell is a coconut? I want to say there could be one back over there on the main island where Tidus is. I think. We got more Palpu fruits as well, so that's pretty nice. Uh, let's see. Uh, anything up here? Just going to do some trunk climbing for the sake of it, although, like I say, we could use first person view. I don't remember where the coconuts are. Oh, please don't tell me I'm going to end up staying here for ages trying to look for this. Uh, let's see. Anything on this tree? No, I don't think so. Hmm, okay. Oh, please don't tell me I have to cut ahead. I don't want to spend too long searching for supplies. And the way I'm going now, this could potentially turn into just a whole episode on its own. Me looking for two coconuts. Because I, I don't remember where they are. I, I don't know, it's right at the start of the game. Like, this is one of the many things that you're expected to forget about a game, really. Uh, okay, let's see. Uh, okay, that's where we found the cloth. So I'm guessing that the coconuts are going to be in a different area. Uh, let's see, we found a rope over here. So that I'm not expecting to find anything. But you never know, there could be something around the perimeter. There could be... Uh, nothing, nothing, tra -la -la. okay. Maybe they are around the other side and I just missed him. Uh, wait a minute. Okay, the current episode's been recording for nine minutes and all we've done is find three fish and mushrooms. Oh, okay. I am starting to think that maybe I should cut ahead. Uh, that bothers me a decent amount. Like, having to cut ahead on the third episode. Like, I try to keep cuts to a minimum. To be honest, I don't like it because it's editing work and that's hard and it makes my life difficult. Boo hoo hoo. Yeah, seriously though. Um, I, I don't like doing cuts. Try to keep these videos constantly flowing, but sometimes push comes to shove. Oh, idea. Idea. Maybe it's in a box. You never know. Come on. Did that have anything in it at all? I don't think it did. What was the point of that, really? 
Uh, okay. Um, tell you what, if I don't find it in the next minute, maybe 30 seconds, then I'm definitely cutting ahead to when I find them. Uh, although, with that said, maybe I should just do it now. Um, ah, screw it. You know what? I'm just going to do that. I'm going to cut ahead until I find these blasted coconuts. I will see you guys in a second. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, I just went on to Google to look this up. Yeah, this is what you got to do. Wait a minute. Hang on. Oh, okay. Uh, from the sounds of it, or well, from the looks of it, rather. What, are some of these coconuts not good enough for you? Oh, Kyrie, you... Friggin', oh, you are, you're heartless yourself, aren't you, Kyrie? Not accepting these. They're perfectly good. There's nothing wrong with them. Uh, I don't know. Like, what am I supposed to do here? Uh, according to Google, the coconuts are supposed to be yellow, and these are clearly brown. So, is, is that it? Am I just supposed to keep going until special coconuts fall out? That's stupid. Uh, it also said you could target lock onto trees, so maybe it's only certain ones. Oh! Oh! Found it! Found it! No, no, no! Don't get on the tree, you wazzik! There we go. Okay, there we go. I target lock the tree. Maybe it's only specialist trees that do it. Freaking hell! Squaresoft, you're tearing me apart. <sighs> okay, you found something. High potion again, thank you. Yes, I absolutely want to call it a day. Let's go home, even though this whole island technically is a home, so that's redundant. Good God in heaven. Right, okay, can we finally get back to the epic stuff? You know, Riku has changed. What do you mean? Well... Hmm. You okay? Sora, let's take the raft and go. Just the two of us. I agree wholeheartedly with that. Oh, for goodness sake. You're the one that's changed, Kyrie. Maybe. You know, I was a little afraid at first. But now I'm ready. No matter where I go or what I see, I know I can always come back here. Right? Yeah, of course. That's good. Sora, don't ever change. Huh? I just can't wait. Once we set sail, it'll be great. Yeah, it's gonna be super major epic. Especially with that sunset, that was gorgeous looking. Oh, and speaking of epic stuff, here we go. Sorry to rush off without saying goodbye, but there's big trouble brewing. I can't do a Mickey Mouse voice, so yeah, sorry about that. Not sure why, but the stars have been blinking out one by one, and that means disaster can't be far behind. I hate to leave you all, but I've got to go check into it. A hero's work is never done. There's someone with a key, the key to our survival, so I need you and Goofy to find him and stick with him. Got it? We need that key or we're doomed. So go to, tra to Travis Town and find Leon. He'll point you in the right direction. Sorry, I almost said Traverse Town. That's not how you do it. Would you apologize to Minnie for me? Thanks, pal. Oh dear, what could this mean? It means we'll just have to trust the king. Gosh, I sure hope he's all right. Yeah, don't worry. We'll find the king and the king. Thank you. Both of you. Yes, sir. Can you take care of them? Of course. You be careful now, both of you. Oh, and to chronicle your travels, he will accompany you. Right. Oh, yeah, here we go. Crick is the name. Jiminy Cricket at your service. We hope for your safe return. Please help the king. <laughs> the dynamic duo set off. It's going to be awesome. Gorge, Jiminy. Your world disappeared too. 
It was terrible. We were scattered. And as far as I can see, I'm the only one who made it to this castle. Your hate. Oh, right. I got you. You mean while we're in other worlds, we can't let on where we're from, huh? We gotta protect the world border. Aga. Right. World border. <laughs> Whoa! Ooh, I guess we'll need new duds when we get there. Huh? I don't actually know what that word means. I don't know if that's stupidity on my part, which is entirely possible. Oh, that ship right there. I remember that. Ah, oh, that's another floor in this game that we can get into. I know the first few episodes of this Let's Play have been a little bit negative. I promise it gets better. But the floors are starting to surface. <laughs> nice one. It's a pretty good start to the whole adventure, isn't it? There they go, blasting off into the great unknown. Dexter's mum from Dexter's Laboratory? That is awesome. It sounds just like her. I like it. That is cool. Oh, I hope I predicted the voice actress correct. That's great. Okay, so I guess right there we technically don't live on the island. It's just really close by to where we actually live. I think is what's going on there. Oh, I guess I was wrong. Sorry about that. Okay, here we go, Heartless time, and I screwed up the first attack. The first proper enemies of the whole game. Like, no longer in a training montage, just genuine, and I screwed it up. Okay, wait, hang on. I think I remember now. If I recall correctly, we can't actually kill them yet. We do actually need to just rage on through, I believe is what's supposed to happen. We can't actually do anything. Now, if I recall... We're supposed to go around the other side. Okay, the door's blocked off right there. Good luck doing anything with that. Yeah, I believe that right here... No, not the seaside shack. I'm trying to recall exactly where we're supposed to go. I believe it's around the other side of the island. Because I believe that's where the raft is stationed. Oh, wait, maybe not. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that the Heartless can't be killed right now. So, oh, there he is. There's Riku. That's what we're supposed to do. I get it now. Sorry, sorry. I'm an idiot. Uh, wait, are these doors active? Yeah, they are. We can go here. And we can save if need be. Uh, how long have we been recording for, actually? Okay, we've been recording for about 18 minutes. This actually is a pretty good place to end it off. Yeah, what do you say we save right here? Don't attack, you numpty. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna save here. This should all be fine. Yeah, there we go. That's a good place to end it off. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.